Hello people of the internet, welcome to this next video in the Star Wars Card Trader app Saturday videos. Uh, today's going to be a little bit longer uh, than normal. Uh, a couple things going on. This is actually my one year anniversary uh, being here on YouTube and also streaming over on Twitch. Um, we did a stream last night and we're also, just so you know, we're going to be streaming tonight somewhere between 9 and 10 Eastern. Uh, we're going to be playing a little bit of the uh, the old Zelda games for the Philips CDI. Uh, last night we played Link the Faces of Evil. Tonight we're going to be playing a little bit of the Zelda Wand of Gamelon. So head over there if you want to check that out. It's um, I've been calling them horribly awesome games because they are very... Uh, very well known for being very bad games, but we actually had some fun last night. But besides that, we're going to get to a couple things today. Uh, we've got a bunch of stuff. Um, we've got the giveaway to do or to announce, and I also have two more cards to give away. I'm um, actually um, pretty much caught up on all of the giveaway stuff here, here soon. Um, so we've got that going. Um, I've got the... Uh, the new thing they just uh, released last night, I went a little bit crazy, and I've gotten like uh, 9 or 10 of those um, first year. It's actually the first year anniversary for the card trader as well, so that's kind of cool how that worked out. So they released that pack last night, and I went a little crazy, and I actually had a guy trade. Uh, I think he traded me like six, six of them for some other stuff, so... I've got uh, just a few to go after uh, of those today, um, but first, the one thing that I'm most excited about, if the app, uh, you know, does work and not take forever to load, we'll see. We got this loaded up. I ended up getting four of these green gradients. The reason why I got four is because you need three to meld them into the red carpet or the, the cloth, red cloth version. Plus then I wanted to keep one to still have in my collection. So we've got that. So I'm gonna do that first here. I wanted to do that live because that'd be kind of kind of cool to do here. So let me uh, go back and get that going. So there they are, the two lore sand cards I need. I don't know when I'm ever going to get the silver one, unless somebody trades it with me. <laughs> but I'm not going to really worry about that. But this one, the red, the cloth red card we're going to get. Uh, wow, I'll be one of the first 100. So let's go ahead and do this meld. We're going to go to the smuggler's den. So you need three to do it. I've got four. So boom. Very awesome. Love it. That made me happy. Anyways, let's get on to opening up some packs here. Um, actually, first, let's go ahead and we'll announce the winners from last week. So let me bring all those up. So the first one up was this red, uh, the red flame trooper pack here. If it lets me select it, the app is being stupid again. Or maybe it's my phone. I don't know. There we go. So there we go. So that first one up here, that was pretty sweet. It was part of the armory pack. Uh, just about 5,300 of them, 5,400 of them out there. So the winner for this one is, get that, Emil Johans Johansson. Sorry about that. So congratulations on that. Let's bring up the second one here. Yeah, it was the battle ready emperor card here. Uh, just about 7,700 of those. Very cool looking. So the winner for this one is MRR Otero. So congratulations on that. And let's go ahead and bring up the third and final. And that third one was actually the one right next to it, right? The Han, the battle ready. Very cool, 8,500 of those. And the winner for that one is Nova Adam 61. So congratulations on that and congratulations to all three of you. Uh, at the end of things here, I'll be announcing the next two cards we're gonna be giving away. There's only two, like I said, I'm almost, well, I'm pretty much caught up on all of the, um, the cards, at least the cards you guys have been sending over. Um, I've got a couple that uh, we'll be doing here in the future, but let's get to opening up some packs. Um, first off, I want to, I think I have master access, right? Because I went after that Endor pack. Yeah, okay, so let me first check. Um, let me first check to see exactly which ones I need to go after. All right, so I wish they had a way you could filter down even more. So I need to go after at least the Phasma. I forgot which one that is. So I need to go after, I think that's the 
the Prism series or something. So that I need to go after the Leia, so the women of Star Wars. I need to go after I think there were four. I need to go after Poe, so the bounty. And then Oh no, that was it. Because I have one of each. As long I well, they have it would be nice to get one of every variant just because they, they do have an award card in the works. Um, but I think they're gonna figure that out after the fact. So at least I could, if I could get one of at least each card, um, and then I'll maybe work on trying to get at least the regular blue variant because I think those are the most common. So again, so I need to go after Bounty to get Poe. I need to go after the the women of Star Wars to get Leia, and then the Prism one. So that's only three. I didn't realize I had that many. All right, well, cool. Let's get to it. And with the master access, um, it gives you a chance of opening up another uh, another one of the version you know, cards. So if I open up this shred pack, you know, I could go after the shred cards, but I also have a chance of opening up an uh, insert from one of the other of the, the eight packs here. So we need to go after the bounty. Um, I guess I could do the master packs. That's fine. Uh, so I need to go after the bounty here to try to get Poe. See what we can get. I have a feeling we may go through a lot of the credits. I usually like to keep close to about 100,000 just if something crazy drops like this. So I'm glad I had a bunch over the last couple days uh, that I was able to open up. Um, I don't know. We may deplete most of my credits here. But I really would like to get all these. Another blue Kylo. That's cool. Why didn't it give me the cool little animation? It was an insert. And they've been doing it in that, that now on Droid. Um, you get... Um, Android, you actually get inserts before the very last card like it used to. So see, like right there, we opened up the Bounty Master and we actually got one that was part of the uh, the Dark Side one there. So that's kind of cool. A new card. Nice. Finn. Wait, I didn't have Finn? I didn't have Finn or po Oh, whoa. What a pack. I thought I had, maybe I had Poe and I needed to get Finn. Or, oh, this is the blue version of Finn. I didn't have that one. Well, this was a great pack, though, all together. Green. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. So, I'm still looking for Poe, though. Still need, so that's the problem, is that they, they released one or two, you know, two cards of each of the types. So, you have a chance of pulling Poe or... Not the right Poe. Poe or Finn on the bounty thing. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll just do a couple of these and then we'll move on. There's another Poe. Or a Finn. Glad I'm getting all these inserts. Let's do... No, that was all the, the bounty one. Elegant weapon I don't need. Uh, women of Star Wars. I need to try to get Leia. Just one of the Leia versions. So let's see. Do what I can do here. And again, these packs only have five cards in them. I'm really starting to hate that they're they're reverting to that for all of these things now. It's a thousand credits a, a card. Kind of annoying. And we'll do one more of those. New card. Nice. That's what I'm looking for. Blue is fine. Very cool. Okay, so we've got all the women of Star Wars. Dark side I don't need to go after. Shadow Box don't need to go after. Mint Press don't need to go after. And then Prism was the last one. And then we need to go back and try to get the bounty for Poe. I need to get the Prism card. That was uh, Phasma. That's what we're looking for. Oh, me, Phasma. No. Um, new card. Yes. Ooh, and it's black, too. I think black is the one out of 100 chance. Awesome. All right, so now we need to go back to the bounty and try to get Poe, and then that'll be it. And then I'll try to try. Hopefully they announce when they're going to drop the uh, the award card so I can try to at least do some training for at least each version of the blue, because those are the more common of them. And this doesn't have any set limit. I saw it's only a, a time, which I kind of wish they would do more often um, where they said I think they said they were going to be done at midnight on the 14th so all through the rest of today saturday um and then also um tomorrow the 13th then um but let's go ahead and open up some more of these bounties hopefully we can get lucky and get him here real quick 
I don't mind opening up packs as much now because it is building up my whites too because uh, I would like to go after a lot of those gold version of the cards. Uh, there's a few that I, I would really like to go after that I've been trading uh, to try to get at least the 100 on. Um, but just building up the collection all together is, is cool. Uh, we actually just passed 20,000. Um, uh, nothing. Uh, just passed 20,000 uh, last night or today, I think. So, pretty cool. Bounty pack doesn't like me today. But we got another fin. How many fins am I going to get? Holy cow. Was that the third fin today? Jeez. Well, now I've got stuff to trade, but really could use that Poe, please. Come on, Poe. We've gone through about 115-ish thousand today. Another fin? Oh, oh, nice. Well, for as much as I'm not getting the Poe card, I'm definitely getting a bunch of these inserts. That is pretty sweet. I think this is the lowest I've been in a long time. I'm not going to be able to open much after this. Hmm, I don't know. I'm going to probably take it down to just 75. And then I think I'll stop there. I don't want to get too low because I know they're going to be releasing something uh, tonight, probably along the lines of the uh, modernography or. I don't know. I don't remember what else is out there right now. I've been focusing on doing this, so this will probably be the last pack here. Maybe we'll get lucky. We'll see. We got Snap, Kit, Wolven, Obi-Wan, Leia. Okay, well. I'll do some trading. I don't want to drag this on any longer here, so I'll do some trading to try to get that Poe. Let me go back and check just to make sure that I do have at least uh, all the cards we we're looking for. Uh, we'll see. We'll see if I can get that maybe in a trade. I've got everything else, though, at least one of every one. So that's kind of cool. So let's go ahead. I'm going to bring up these. Uh, oh, I don't know why I went out of that. I'm going to bring up the two cards we're going to be giving away for this week. Um, so let's bring those up here. All right, and the first card up this week is part of the Red Squadron Pack uh, series. Uh, this was a few months ago, I think. Uh, about 31,000 on there, Red 8, Bren, Quirzy. Uh, this one was actually donated over to us by La Mens. Sorry if I didn't pronounce that correct. Um, but uh, thank you so much for sending that card over. So in the description or in the comments below, uh, just leave the word red, and I'll know you're interested in this one here. And of course, all the details will be in the uh, the description below. All right, and the second one up here was part of this one that's, um, I think it's an ongoing. No, this is, I don't think this is ongoing anymore. Uh, this is the Rebel Propaganda, Propaganda package or inserts here. Uh, very cool. It's got about, a, only about 100, 150,000 on there. Um, this one was given to us by Heavy Kevy 646 so thank you so much for sending that over. So if you're interested in this one down below, just put the word poster and I'll know you'll be interested in this. Um, and that's really all we've got today then. Uh, we did a bunch of stuff, opened up some packs, got a bunch of inserts. I'll try to be getting that last uh, that last Poe um, bounty card. Hopefully we can get that before tomorrow. I think we should be able to. Um, but uh, maybe I'll do some trading with you guys or whatnot. But anyways, thank you for checking this out again. Check us out on tonight on Twitch for celebrating our one-year anniversary here on YouTube. Uh, we start around about 9, 10 Eastern or so. We're going to be playing some of the old Zelda CDI games again. So thank you so much for checking this out. And if you are new to the channel, go and subscribe. That would be awesome. And if you like these videos, like it looks like you guys do, uh, please leave a couple likes down below. That does help out as well. And thank you again for all the trades and everything you guys have been doing. Uh, as always, thank you so much for, for that. And I'm, hopefully I'm getting to everybody that I can that, you know, to get people some good trades and fair trades and everything. I try to do my best. So, But if you guys have any ideas for games or apps you want to see, uh, let me know. Or any games you want to see streamed over on Twitch, let me know. We'll do our best to... You know, play a couple uh, couple hours of a game or something like that. So, uh, again, thank you for stopping by, checking this out. I'll talk to you guys soon, and as always, keep on gaming.